Right, Michael Conlin here with uh, uh, Sabat.com. My name is Miguel. Michael, uh, first and foremost, how are you feeling? I feel good, Miguel. All yeah. good. How are you? All right. Cool, cool. Um, tired? You, you didn't roll? I mean, no. Nah. No. Listen, uh, I chased the guy there and then he, did, he, he probably done more mails than people do marathons, but you know, uh, I was happy with my performance. I stay, I stay calm, I stay cool, and you know, I got the job done. Yeah, that's what I was going to ask you actually, because you didn't seem to get like frustrated at all or like kind of uh, impatient or anything. You kind of kept on it. I just stuck to my job and, and I knew what I had to do and, and, and how I had to do it. So I knew I had to be patient because. I actually expected them that they can't maybe try a bit more. I don't know why. I, 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 I'm honest, I didn't want the opponent because I, I didn't think he was going to do me any favors. And he didn't. He just ran. He didn't, he didn't try to fight. I think if you get an opponent, they got to try hard to do it. And I thought I'd done a good job of, of staying composed and looking good by doing it uh, with an opponent like that. Yeah, uh, you went to the body a lot, you know, try to slow him down a little bit. You were even warned about some of the punches. Did you feel those punches really went low? Or is... I, I didn't think they were low. My corner was going crazy at the ref because it was bullshit. Like they, no, no way they were low. They were on the belt, but his shorts were very high. Yeah, I noticed that. After the fight, uh, he was complaining. He even started doing it push-ups. Did you notice that? Uh, listen, he maybe could have went on. I'm not saying he could have went on. I think he could have went on. I think it was, it was going to happen anyway. It was going to get stopped. But at the same time, the ref probably just got sick of watching this guy run around the ring. He was taking some, before before the stoppage, he took three big consecutive right hands and he looked like he was going to go and then he tucked up the ropes and maybe it was enough, maybe the ref, maybe it was a smart stoppage. Yeah, I think so. Um, so, fight's over, another one's in the bag. Uh, what's next? December 22nd, Manchester. Oh, yeah. who? Do you know who? Uh, I'm not too sure yet, but we're looking for a top 15. Uh, opponent uh, and some sort of tail. So that's what we're looking for now. That's, that's, that's the aim. I, I think I need, these, I need a better challenge, I need better test because the better the opponent, the better I perform. And that's what I'm looking for. Uh, Have you fought in Vegas before? No, my, this is my Vegas debut. Um, I'm happy with it. That's probably more, more happy with my outfit than yeah. anything. <laughs> I, love, yeah. I love the kids today. So I'm, I think I'm going to stick with the red black. Right on. How are you enjoying it so far? Besides the, you know, having to have your mind focus on the fight, how are you enjoying Vegas? Hello. I've been to Vegas many times. Oh um, yeah. You know, when I stay in the top rank, and then I've been like on Andre Ward, Kovalev, one or two, uh, Canelo, Chavez. Sure. Um, so I've been here a good few times. So I enjoy it. It's, it's a lovely place. It's a great city. There's so much thing to do. It, it's a good city to go and fight in because you're you're not thinking about the boxing. You've got so much things to distract you, which is great. And, and then we need to focus. We can go to the top rank gym, we can go to the gym in the hotel or something to get the ones in. So uh, I'm happy. I've, I've enjoyed Vegas. It's my biggest debut. I'm, I'm happy with it. I got, I've got a, a stop with victory. So, you know, it's, it's another one for that. Yeah, definitely. Got rounds in there for sure. Uh, all right. Well, Michael, thank you so much for your, uh, for your time, man. I appreciate it one more time. Have yourself a good night and thank you so much again, man.